was sifting through Pokemon cards in one of my storage areas when I stumbled across a pre-release kit. As I took a closer look, I realized it's an X and Y Steam Siege pre-release kit, and I thought, why not open it in today's video? Now, Steam Siege doesn't have the best reputation, but honestly, I think it's aged pretty nicely. There's really cool secret rares such as Gardevoir and Volcanion, as well as the full arts like Steelix. So today, let's travel back in time to 2016 and open up some X and Y Steam Siege. Alright, so if you guys haven't seen a full pre-release kit, it's pretty cool. You get a booster box, which is up here. There's a bunch of energies in here, and then there's a whole bunch of uh, build and battle boxes. Man, these are getting kind of old, so this is pretty cool because you get four packs in here, and then you also get one of four different pre-release cards. Now, you never know which pre-release card you're going to get out of here. It's completely randomized, so let's see if we can maybe get all four of them in today's video. And honestly, I don't even know what the four are in this because I've never opened up pre-release Steam Siege kit. And we're going to check that out in just a second, but I want to let you know that I'm giving away another Paldea Evolved booster box to one subscriber here on the channel. So make sure to the giveaway by number one, smashing the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, the moment of truth. Let's see if we get in our X and Y steams. And I know like uh, the people call this like a steaming pile of you know what and just like... <laughs> People, people uh, have a lot to say about this set, so let me know. I'm curious if you guys are into this set or not, but here's a little thing that it comes with a little insert. So, X and Y Steam Siege 2016 Dual Powers Clash. So, there's that on the front, and then there's some pre-release tips on the back with Gardevoir. Then, of course, you get four booster packs, and oh, we actually get all four pack artworks on that one. Now, inside of here, it's going to be some cards, and the main card, I believe, should be on the front. So, let's see what we get. Oh, nice. So we get a Volcanion, and that's going to be the pre-release stamp on there. It says Steam Siege. Pretty solid card to get out of here, and you can only get these out of these pre-release kits. Um, but besides that, you have more cards, so you can kind of build a deck. Pyroar, Great Ball, Switch, Giovanni Schemes in there. Uh, we got Litleos, Ponytas, Rapidash, Yan Mega, some more Giovanni, some more Yanma, Tangela, Tangrowth, and a Code card. They also have versions of these that actually have a st uh, staff like stamp on it as well. This one's just like the classic normal pre-release card. All right, so let's open up some of these Steam Siege packs. 2016 X and Y era. Honestly, we get the Gardevoir Secret Rare or potentially the Volcanion Secret Rare. This is a really cool Steelix that I want to pull in here. Professor Sycamore is pretty cool as well. All the break cards in here are nice. Nidoran, but I like the artworks on here. I think they're cool. Galvantula Reverse and a Talon Flame. But yeah, I'm curious, like, again, what you guys think of this. Maybe just watch this video. Let me know what you think of Steam Siege. If you didn't know when it released 2016, everybody was like, oh, this is the worst set ever. It's so bad. But, like, <laughs> I don't know. Looking back, it's not it's not really that bad. Clink Clang and a Jump Bluff. And booster boxes now are going for around $300. I mean, it's, like, even, like, the sets that are kind of, like, notorious for being, like, the worst, like, I don't know, set or whatever, like, most people vote as, like, the worst set end up kind of like going up in value anyway like this set is i mean a box is 300 dollars. like that's definitely pretty expensive sneasel reverse and a nido king look at that artwork steam seas pack number four can we get something other than a green coat oh green coat cards everywhere tang growth i think we could still get a break card fungus ashawat mantine reverse that's pretty cool and an armaldo all right let's open it another pre-release kit let's see if we get another one of the four pre-release cards here and i i i better not double up <laughs> with my luck i'm gonna double up all right we'll see we'll see let's go right to it it is oh we got hoopa okay hoop again featured and then again we get all four pack artworks i wonder if that's normal all right let's get this out of here we got two of the four already two for two so far looking good code card and that it's usually the last one that i always struggle to get hoopa there we go Nice, and then this is going to be just different cards in here. Nidoran, Nidorino, Nido King, Tangela, Tangrowth's in there. But yeah, what makes this special basically is that Steam Seeds little stamp right there on the bottom right. All right, let's get some pulls. Come on. It's not really helping our case right now to not get anything out of these. Okay, why did that open so weird? Can I, can I look at it? Oh, no. Dude, what is with the green code cards? Litwick. Oh, Weavile. Have we got green code cards on every single pack that we opened so far? That's not good. I'm going to keep looking. Oh, my God. What? That's such bad luck. Meowth. Nosepass. Oh, dude. Come on. What is with this luck? It, oh, my God. Stop. Maggie. Oh, wait a second. We still get a break card. Boom! There we go. Our first official hit is going to be that Pyroar. What do you guys think of that one? Ooh, very sparkly. Okay. 
Man. I'm over here trying to get a pull, trying to prove that Steam Siege is, is decent, and I, I, we can't even get a pull. Oh, my gosh. Oh, finally. Thank you. That's so amazing. That's our, our eighth pack. That's finally not a green code card. We could celebrate, hopefully. Shello, Hoopa, Reverse. And a clean line. You know what? I actually want to open this. This is uh basically, usually it's energies. But I remember opening an X and Y pre-release one time. And there was actually like this cool card. I didn't even remember what card it was. But I remember there was a cool random card just thrown in there. And I, like, I almost didn't see it. But I always check everything. So let's just open this just to make sure. Um, oh, we go like this. Okay. Oh, wait. Don't tell me that's something. Don't tell me that's something. Should we look? Because these are, I mean, those should be energy. It's on top, though. It's so weird. Should we look? Oh, oh, dude. That's uh, the staff cards. Oh, my God. Wait. That's what I was talking about. So that's where they put the staff cards? Dude, wait. That must just be for, like, certain X and Y sets. Because that, that can't be how they always were. I thought they sent them in, like, sealed in little plastic. They, they normally send them in, like, little plastic bags sealed. Did you just throw them in here? Dude, that's actually insane. Hoopa, Steam Siege, pre-release staff card right there. I actually just looked it up. Only two of these exist in a PSA 10. I wonder why. Because they just throw it in there. Um, yeah, I don't know if this could get a 10 or not. But, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Okay. So, I want to check. I want to check. I want to check just to make sure. I think when I did it last time, there was it was just, like, in the side. It was, like, the last card. But now the, like that we had one in here... I have to I have to look through this. It's probably just going to be energies, but uh, I I won't be able to sleep at night unless I look through this just to double check to see if there's like any more staff cards thrown in here. That's kind of crazy. Now I wonder what the other pre-release cards were because that means we could have got any of those as a staff card besides Hoopa. That is kind of interesting to me. All right, all right. So less stack here. It's probably all energy, but we have to look. And yeah, okay, it's all energy, but there was the one on top. All right, we are on the hunt right now. Let's see if we can get our third pre-release card that we have not pulled yet and to get some pulls out of this set because right now all we got is that break card, and that's not looking too good. So let's see. All right, number three. Oh, I knew it was, was going to happen. Hoopa is just taking over right now. All right, Hoopa and then the four packs, all different pack artworks again. But yeah, Hoopa is everywhere. We got the staff card Hoopa. We got the right. <laughs> we got two of the regular Hoopas. Why? Can we not get anything from Steam Siege? I'm starting to hate this set now. Come on. Can't be green. Can't be green. Yes. All right. Finally, our second non full green code card. This is a Pokey Miracle right now. Shellos. Meryl. C Dot. Ooh, Azumarill. That looks sick. And. Oh my god, we actually got something. We actually got something from Steam Siege. It's going to be Steelix EX. The classic e EX throwback. Finally, these things are starting to hit a little bit here. Better not go right back to nothing, though. Yep, yeah, okay. Apom. Mareep. Meryl Spiritome. Okay, Tangrowth. Don't know what the other two... Okay, let me try to guess. Based on the set, I would say one of the other pre-release... One of the other pre-release cards is probably going to be Gardevoir. Maybe Steelix. Oh, I'd like to get Steelix or Gardevoir. Come on, Steelix or Gardevoir. If that's even a thing, I will take it. Come on. Or one of the ones that we don't have. I'm going to double up again. It's going to be a Hoopa. Watch this. It's going to be a Hoopa. Oh, I can never catch a... Oh, I can never catch a break. Dude, this is getting fierce now. I'm actually, like, so surprised... Unbelievable. Wow. It's just like, I don't know. Just kind of, oh, it's just not happening. Right. Ooh, never mind. Your belt up. Break, break cards in this. Break cards in uh, Steam Siege are actually pretty cool. This your belt looks pretty sick. All right, two more Steam Siege coming up. Can we do it? Ooh, maybe, 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 maybe. Maybe. I would like to pull full art at this point, or or make it a secret rare at this point. Rufflet, Infernape, oh, nice hollow. Are we about to make our comeback right now with Steam Siege? Let's see. One, two, three. From the back to the front. We got Halucha. We got Litwick, Mareep, Krogunk, Ponyta, nice. Oh, 
Moongus. Well, this is the booster box, by the way. I thought we'd be onto this by now. I thought we would have got all the pre-release cards. or pretty close to it. At least three, right? Uh, but that's that's the booster box. We'll see if we get to this today or not. If we're just going to be going ham on these uh, pre-release kits. Because there's a bunch. they put a bunch in here. There's, I think there's like eight in there. We've only opened four. This is going to be our fifth one. Yes! Oh, okay, Klaltzer. I was not expecting that at all. But that's going to be our third of four. Yes, okay. Three of four. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I have not seen this one yet. So this could have been a staff one if we had it in that other bulk thing or that uh, energy thing. But that looks pretty sick. And then here's the cards that you get in here. Nidoran, Nidorino, Nido King, Asha Watts in there. Cool. Samurai. Pretty cool. More Asha Watts in the back. Are those different artworks? All right, pre-release cards rolling in now. All right, do I look? Yes. No, of course not. Of course not. I think we've probably only got like three or four... Ooh, Nidoran Reverse. Cool. Baleon. I think we only got three or four packs that actually had, like, a good code card. Maybe that's four right there. Four or five. Uh, we're doing three, right? Three from the back. Wait, is that three? No, that's not three. That's three. There we go. I was about to say. Uh, but maybe we can get a secret rare one of these days. That would be nice. Or even just a full art. Drifloon, CDOT. Ooh, nice reverse, Wellius. And a Mega Gardevoir EX. The best pull of the day so far. Finally! <laughs> Finally, dude! I thought we were just gonna get nothing. Nice, 100% best pulled so far. And actually, this is like right under the secret, the two secret rares in terms of like most valuable card in the set. We got like the third most valuable card in the set. Automatically, the best pre-release kit so far. I never would have thought we'd be opening up Steam Siege in 2023, but here we are. Needle King Reverse, nice. Of course, green code card. Is the pull rates tougher on Steam Siege, or is this just my luck right now? I'm gonna say it's probably just my luck, but the ultimate thing I would like to pull, the ultimate thing I would like to pull would be a secret rare, either Gardevoir or Volcanion. Either one of those looks amazing. I'll be cool. All right, and we still have to get our fourth pre-release card. What is it gonna be? It has to be Gardevoir, right? They gotta put Gar Gardevoir is everywhere in this. Maybe not though. I don't know. Let's see. What's it gonna be? Oh, <laughs> of course. Hoopa! Of course, of course, of course, of course. Should have known. This is the most pulled by far. Far is going to be the Hoopa. I'll give you guys that code card too. Three regular Hoopa pre-release cards and one staff makes four total. That's a lot of Hoopas. And we still need that fourth pre-release card. Whatever it is, hopefully we can get it. We don't have too many left. These flap A and jump. Oh, These packs, X and Y are, they fall apart. Way easier for some reason. <gasps> That's what we need green and white code card this is our time right now give me a secret rare chimchar tangle oh cobalion reverse infernape again on the hollow i'm gonna look oh my god that is the worst what is the worst that's like the worst amount of uh i know what i'm saying but that's bad we just had so many green code cards i know somebody's probably keeping count and it's like it's got to be ridiculous at this point how 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 bad it is on the green code cards. Is that just a Steam Siege thing? Just to double down on how bad it is? Lit Leo and a Nido King. We are down to our final two pre-release kits. This might just be a pre-release, um, actual just pre-release things being opened and not the booster box. I don't even know if we have time for the booster box now. We've been spending so much time on these. Come on. Oh my God, it's gonna be a Volcanion. Oh my God. It's getting up there with the Hoopa now. Wow, and they really do put all the pack artworks in these. We only have one more shot. Oh, that's a good sign. We only have one more shot to get that last pre-release card. We got, we're going to be on the eighth pre-release kit. That's our only shot to get the fourth one. Steelix EX. Okay. It's weird. We doubled up on Inferno Apollo. We're doubled up on Steelix EX. All right. Three Steam Siege packs on the table here. Let's make them count. Oh, my God. Wow. Now, I mean, I think we probably got, like, six green and white code cards out of, like, I think we're probably on, like, 32 packs by now, maybe. So, let's see. Ooh, I didn't even check this one. I didn't even check this one. Maybe this is the one that we've been waiting for, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> That's the mime of the set right there. That is the mime of Steam Siege for me. It's Hoopa. This will just be the icing on the cake right now. <sighs> of course. Oh, man. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying Steam Siege. Jan Mega. Meanwhile. This is going to be our last chance. This is our final pre-release kit. 
trying to see if we can get all four of these pre-release cards. If it ain't in here, it's gonna be a hoopa. I'm just gonna, it's gonna be a hoopa. It's gonna be a hoopa. There's no other way around it, it's gonna be a hoopa. Well, hoopa. We got it! What? <laughs> yes! Wow! I am shocked. I didn't think we were gonna get all four of them. Yan Mega, honestly, one of the coolest ones, too. Yan Mega! Wow, and I was completely wrong on which ones they put in as pre release cards. Yan Mega! That hollow looks really good. Ashawat. Alright, let's make this the best pre release kit. Yan Mega! Yanma! Tangula! Tangula! That is pretty cool to get all those like that. That's pretty cool. Alright. I'm happy about that. Ooh, happy about that. Let's go. Make this the best one, baby. Come on. This is our Steam Siege comeback right now of 2023. Open a Steam Siege in 2023. Bit sharp. All right. Like, what are the odds? What are the odds? What are the odds? I don't know. Well, that's a green code card. Nope. Final two, final two. I'm trying. I'm trying to stay optimistic for this opening. But it just, every time, it just, ugh, it just cuts a little deeper every time. Mankey, Apom, C Dot. Okay, forgot about those again. Talon Flame Break card looks pretty good. That's actually, yeah, th break cards are pretty decent pull rate, I feel like. They're pretty, they're pretty decent. And why can't I open this penny sleeve? And you get them on green code cards. So I guess it's not the end of the world if you get a green code card. All right, our final Steam Siege pack. I really wanted to get one of those secret rare cards. But probably really tough. I can't even bear to look at this. That was risky. All right. All right, make the last pack the best pack. Right now with the Poke Puff. Hangrove. Pokemon Ranger. Hop it. Fletchling. Come on. Chimchar. All right, Shellos. Ooh, Xerneas. Even the regular hollows are actually pretty cool in this set. Going in the sleeve, and I think we're just going to save this Steam Siege booster box for another day. Maybe we'll open it up in a couple more years. I don't know, but we do have one Steam Siege box in the collection now. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.